Hello, and welcome to New England Escapades. Today we took a trip to the Rhode Island School of Design Museum of Art in Providence, Rhode Island. Here's what we learned on our adventure. Located at the corner of College and North Main in Providence, the Rhode Island School of Design, or RISD, Museum of Art in Providence, was founded in 1877. It's currently the 20th largest art museum in the United States and contains over 100,000 works of art. Of these works, 2,300 of them are on display currently in the museum, while 82,196 of them are available to view online. The museum has an extremely liberal policy on public domain, allowing all images found of their collection to be used for any purpose. In addition to works by famed painters such as Picasso and Pollock, the museum also hosts thousands of works by lesser-known artists. From extremely ornate furniture to unusual product designs to clothing, there's really a little bit of everything here. In particular, we enjoyed an antique turtle soup serving set from the era when people actually ate turtle soup. We were able to visit during the temporary Defying the Shadow exhibit, which features the work of dozens of black artists. According to the museum's website, Beginning with Sojourner Truth's abolitionist portraits stamped up with the slogan, I sell the shadow to support the substance, these assembled works, ranging from 19th century photographs to contemporary prints, focus on the appearance of shadows in formal and metaphorical settings. While there certainly is a focus on the history of art, there are plenty of contemporary pieces on display. Ranging from modern furniture design to mixed media sculptures, there is an impressive array of modern art on display at the museum. Even for the most cynical viewer of art, there are certainly accessible works to see. While we didn't get a chance to visit on our trip, Cafe Pearl is located on site for sandwiches, salads, and beverages if you need a break on your visit. And you likely will, because as we've said, there is a ton to see here. There are a lot of free amenities at the museum as well, including free lockers and chroma eyeglasses for those with color blindness, and activity guides for children. Speaking of which, children under 18 have free admission to the museum. Rhode Island School of Design Museum of Art is located at 20 North Main Street in Providence. It's about an hour's drive from Boston, and with so much to see, it's probably best to make a day of your visit. Be forewarned that street parking is pretty light in the immediate vicinity of the museum. The closest parking lot we were able to find is located on Dyer Street, about a five minute walk away. But once you've parked and gotten into the museum, you'll find that any minor hassles were worth it. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe to see more like it. Thank you for watching, and keep on adventuring!